Um, it's for life for a kid. Um, I know that um, a few of the players' um, girlfriends and wives are um, doing a walk um, up Ben Nevis and um, trying to raise some funds for um, a very good charity. So um, hopefully this can raise a bit more money and um, go to a good cause. <laughs> some of theirs have been quite funny. I'm hoping mine's a little bit more serious. I fancy myself as a model, so... No, I'm only joking, not in the slightest. Like I say, it's, it's all about trying to raise money for charity, so anything that will make people buy it. I think I want to first still put the hand up, but um, it's not how I expected it to be. Um, still on the main road uh, with my shirt off, but um, yeah, <laughs> it wasn't bad, it was all right. You're carrying a boiler, I bet you've never done that before. Oh, I've carried one, but not mood. <laughs> You say, you say put it into words, but it's difficult to put it into words because it is such a big game. Um, not only with it being Wakefield, but at the Magic Weekend as well, that, that's a completely di different atmosphere as well. So, But th there's nothing we, we ate more than losing. Again, eight more losing to Wakefield as well. So it's going to be the biggest game of the year so far, I think. Possibly the biggest game of the year all year. Yeah, absolutely. Um, it's, it, it means a lot, does this game, to everyone involved in the Wakefield district. So um, both teams are struggling at the minute, fighting for points, and um, both teams are trying to climb that table. So it's a massive game, and uh, everything will be will be played for on um, Saturday. And um, I'm sure both teams will looking, be looking to take two points from the game. Yeah, um, no, the, it's yeah, it's good to play in a local derby in that kind of atmosphere. So. Um, yeah, really looking forward to it and been training, training really hard so the boys are pretty keen for it too.